Hello everyone, my name is Seanathan, and welcome back to King's Quest VIII. Um, oh, before I go any further than this, you may notice that I have this microphone up. I'm even flicking it, and it's not messing with anything. And there's a very specific reason why for that. I got a new microphone. Um, I'm not gonna... I guess I can turn the camera around and show it to you. This right, this right there. Is the, there it is. You see my microphone? Isn't it so cute? It's my favorite microphone that I've ever had. It's the best. Anyways, <clears throat> let's um, uh, get back into the game, shall we? Ah, okay. I'm going to need to draw my S word, because there are guys with bows here in a second. Come on, Connor. There we go. Hey, mortals cannot enter Lord Asriel's <clears throat> sanctum. Hark, spirit. To, to the, the contest, contest, then. then. I will skin you and pick your bird. Take that, Skellington. Uh, what puts it away? Is it C? Is it X? Is it Z? No. Is it alternate? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not very good at this, in case you couldn't tell. Oh wow, it wasn't beyond your reach. Good job, Connor, you're moving up in the world. I pushed Q, I didn't push... No, I pushed Shift. That's what I pushed. Ah! Stop it! I'm so good at games. Okay, let's see. Let's thoroughly explore the area. These things offer little hints. At the appointed time, all shall be judged. I mean, that one, not so much, but they do provide you with hints. A lot of them do. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Ere the lever of life spins around the pedestals of death to unlock the sacred sanctum of Azrael, Lord of Death. <clears throat> so the lever of life spins around the pedestals of death. And we know? I have the lever of life. You no, know, that's the lever of life. Okay, now let's draw this sword here. I'm gonna draw my sword here. There we go. Ah! Get up. Yeah. Okay, did you guys drop anything at all? No, that's rude. Making me go through all the trouble of killing you and don't even drop crap! Those uh, specters flail about randomly, but they will damage you if they run into you. I'm worried about this. Hmm, maybe I shouldn't be. Fallen warrior, how how came this? Why, even, even this iron shield is broken, broken in pieces. pieces. All right. <clears throat> la 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 la. Leveling up all over the place. Shrooms and gold and ooh, more gold. Hut! Okay. The specter of death guards over the lever of life. <laughs> this is the specter of death guards over the lever of life. I'm lever of life. I'm thinking Lord Azriel is the. Who might this stone idol represent? I'm uh, thinking Lord Asriel's the Spectre of Death, but I'm not positive if that's what they're implying by that. These. This is a curious slot in this pedestal. This is the pedestal Something of death. Fit here. Or death's pedestal. I forget what the item is. Aha! It fits. <clears throat> okay. Now this piece of iron here. I carry a broken piece of iron shield. It um, uh, you can. Oh, I didn't see that before. You can do one of two things with it. You can either use it for a, a thing now, 
and then use it for something and then use a different piece of iron for something else much much later or you cannot use it now and you can use this piece of iron or the other piece of iron in the quest later uh, you, you can guess which one I'm going to do oops there we go This is the weirdest door lock I've ever seen. Dun, dun, dun. Sound. The door opened. Could this be the sanctum of Lord Asriel? Whoever Wherever he is? I don't know. Okay, now I forget the pattern. But I think it's this one first. I completely forget the pattern. Nope, that's not it. Sounds. Oh, this is Crazy W first, right? And then it's this guy next. Yeah. And then the boob. And then... The crazy H? Yeah. And then this symbol. I forget if that's male or female, but it's that one. <clears throat> one of my favorite characters in the game, Lord Azrael. Thou young mortal, thou art the champion eternal. Methought thou wouldst be more regal. Tis true, I sprang not from noble stock. But my resolve is strong, and my challenge is clear. And sire, may I inquire of your identity? I am known as Azrael, lord of the dimension of death. But now I feel I rule over not. My gods, they have revolted. They have fallen under the influence of wickedness. And the souls they once shepherded, they run amok. How came this, my lord? Thou knowest, the mask of eternity. It hath been ravaged. Corruption hath triumphed. But thou, Sir Champion, hast been chosen to defeat this vile wickedness. And I can aid thee. Compound of death. On its far side, thou shalt find the river of death. Cross it to continue thy journey to the realm of the sun. The realm of the sun? Aye, tis the sacred realm of the mask of eternity. Tell me, Lord Azrael, I am seeking four lost pieces of the mask. Do you have any knowledge of their locations? Unhappily, I know not. So be it. I will persevere and find them. I will return the mask to its rightful place. The world will be sweet once again. A short answer, champion. Farewell to me. And that was my conversation with Lord Asriel. He's actually a big softie. <clears throat> Go, go up here, unlock the compound of death. Before I do though, I think I can 
shoot arrows through the bars and kill these guys. What the? Yeah. Okay. That ought to do it. Aha! The key worked. Okay. Hmm, I saw a couple shrooms fly, I thought. But I'm only seeing one on the oh. Blending in with that skeleton. Because for whatever reason that skeleton had organs. Okay, but yeah, over here. Oh man, this took me so many hours to remember the last time I played this game. And I didn't mean literal hours. And I don't know why. The fact that this tiny chest was here, and in this chest, there's a key. And that took me way longer than it should have. Okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead now and fight the second biggest battle in this level. Um, no. No. There's two battles bigger than this one, so I'm gonna go ahead now and fight the third biggest battle in this level. I'm, uh... It's actually, this is a guy that you technically cannot beat. That's how tough he is. But, because of how you trick him into dying, I guess, is the only way I know how to put it. I'm, uh, you can easily defeat him. I'm, uh, when we say you cannot beat him, I mean, no matter how many times you attack him, he takes no damage. And, as far as I'm concerned, that means you can't beat him. But you can cause him to die. And that's where the difference lies. Um, uh, and he gives you chainmail armor, which is just... It's so delicious. <clears throat> and he's sitting right up here, waiting on me to come up and... Give him a hug. Come forward, mortal. I, I crave, crave your soul. soul. If, if, if you can't see what I'm doing by now, I'll explain it here in just a second. No, 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 that's not what's supposed to happen. There we go. My soul is not there yours for the taking. <clears throat> yeah, when I was a kid, my dad is the one that figured that out. And he figured it out by complete accident. He was just attacking him and fighting him, trying to beat him. And he kicked him off the edge. <clears throat> so, I mean... You know, I, I had no idea that you know, it was like that. By the way, there's one other enemy that you have to attack in that manner. By smacking him like that and beating him back. Um, uh, that happens a little bit later in the game, though. But, um... Uh, I think he's put here so you can know you can kill enemies like that, and then because so, the guy that you fight Excellent. later is a legit Chain boss that you need to beat. So um, uh, <clears throat> I think this guy, the skeleton, was put here just for the purpose of letting you know that you can beat people that way. Now I can get up there. All that's up there is, I believe, um, is I believe uh, all that's I believe all that's up there is a. Uh, a potion of ultimate healing, um, uh, whatever this is called. The elixir of life. The elixir of life. <laughs> um, uh, a bottle of the elixir of life, and, um, uh, a, uh, a, uh, oh, some money. And you use a lot less money in this game than you think you do. It, um, uh, you know. Can just don't fly towards me? Um, 
I mean, like, you think, oh, a role-playing game, you're gonna use all the monies. No, you don't. Yeah, first group of animals you kill and get experience for it. I don't remember it being much, but hey, every little bit helps. Now, what's... Pansy. Now you... I don't remember what you do. You shut off something. Whoa, not you, not you, not you. Uh, those guys upset me. Just hurry up and die. Yes. Also, when they die, they leave specters, of course. Sweet. Oh, yes. Oh, that makes me so happy. Uh -huh. The soul goes round upon a wheel of stars, and all things return. I really don't know. That hint is supposed to hint at something, but I don't know what. Uh, I really don't. I'm, uh, I ha I've had a few guesses. Give me your best. But I don't know exactly. I'm not going to say that I do. Die! Oh, is this the safe zone? I don't think so. No, this is the... Yeah, this is the exit. Die! Die, you monkey! Dying a lot more than I remember usually dying in this game. Your death is mine. Take that. Think you can beat me at chess? You might be able to. I'm not very good at chess. Blood. Whence came it? What? I'm thinking something we're gonna miss there. Ugh. And go hog wild with mushrooms. There we go. Shedding of blood leads to the pallor of death. The <clears throat> and if we do everything there is to do, we get to see Azrael again a little bit later. But yeah, that's all there is to it at this point. Okay. Need to speak to my buddy Karen. Hey, Karen. How's it going? Sir Boatman, I require passage across the River of Death. Only souls of the deceased may embark thus. Thou art a man living. Just this once? My vessel is incorporeal. Thou art physical. Then pray tell, how may a mortal man such as myself ever hope to cross the river? Seekest thou the bridge? Life. Aye, sir. I shall. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Beware the river of death. Its black water shall corrode all it touches. Now this is a massive hint. I'm going to tell you, a character tells you a little bit later that you need, that she needs mold, or I'm sorry, rust. She needs rust, so I take the iron shield. Wonder. And I dip it in the river of death, whose black water spread all touches. I have rusty a metal. Iron shield covered in rust. 
and I have to be very careful around the river of death because it um uh, if you just touch it, it kills you. Let's see. Let's skin you and fit your bones. I know I've been playing for quite some time. Um, but there's one thing I wish to... I wish to do before I... end. <laughs> That's what we call a massacre. I can find what I'm looking for. No, I still haven't found. There we go. Well, I was gonna try to find something else, but this works just as well. Put my weapon away. Let me get rid of this nonsense here. Push these out of the way. There's four of these blocks. Each of the four are in the four corners of this little area down here. Uh, once I get him pushed out of the way, I'll come back and find you again. Okay. I possess a magic map. Okay, so I did that. They were here, 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 and here. What I wanted to do was right here, but that's okay. I'll do it next time. But, you want to push us out of the way? So you could meet my dear friend, wherever she is. My dear friend, the Sylph. There she is. Um, uh, before getting any closer, um, uh, based on how they have her standing and, you know, her design and her outfit and everything, I'm guessing she's supposed to be, like, super hot. Um, uh, as I get closer, you can see she is not. Hail, fair lady. May I slake my thirst at your well? I pray thee, partake of my rejuvenating water. Beware, though, the corrosive water of the river of death. Tell me, fair maid. Are you well in this wretched place? Oh, I, I am not afeard. My magic protects me. <clears throat> My magic can protect thee also. If you know what I mean. Oh. Bring me some rust and mold. By mixing those with my rejuvenating waters, I can concoct for thee a potent protective spell. Done. Let's see, that's what she is. She's in the rust and mold. Here's the rust. I have gained, fair lady, some rust. Will this do? <clears throat> Perfect. And just so you know, this is the, uh, the water that you, that you um, uh, drink in this level to refill your health. Anyways, I'm going to end this episode off here. Uh, you know, got some... I played for quite a while, we got some good distance on. Um, uh, I may be able to finish in the next episode and only have two episodes for this, for this level. Um, it depends on how long it takes me. Um, I don't know. I may do it next, I may finish in this episode, it may be two more, uh, we'll figure it out as we go, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, but anyways, uh, thank all you guys so very much for watching, uh, if you liked it, be sure to hit the like button, and I will see all you guys in the next video. Terminator.